Are you a dairy producer? Or do you grow grapes, nuts, fruits, or vegetables? We have it all with American Vineyard, Pacific Nut Producer, California Fresh Fruit, California Dairy, and Vegetable West magazines. Subscribe for free now at malcomedia.com to stay current on the freshest news in your industry. Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with Vegetables West Magazine, and I'm here today with researcher Mary Ruth McDonald, who addressed growers at the annual California Garlic and Onion Symposium in Tulare. In addition to issues with downy mildew and white rot, some growers are also having problems with onion neck rot, and Mary Ruth had some advice in taking care of that. If you're a grower with onion neck rot, and uh, there are a couple of things to keep in mind. The first one is that cultural controls are really important. Uh, if onions are harvested when the necks are uh, thick, if the crop isn't really mature, um, you can end up with 100% neck rot after a few months in storage, and fungicide application is not going to fix that or um, reduce neck rot enough to make it worthwhile. Um, we've seen that uh, the white dehydrator onions are very susceptible to neck rot, um, probably a lot more susceptible than a, a yellow bulb onion, for instance. And the growers probably know that already, but uh, the white onions uh, really need that higher level of management and cultural control. We've been working on fungicide application. Uh, we found that products such as Fontellus and Quadris Top uh, will reduce disease, uh, but uh, just to go back without good management practices, the fungicides on their own will uh, not be much help. Um, economically, spraying to control neck rot probably isn't worthwhile, but those fungicides also reduce a lot of uh, other foliar diseases, purple blotch, botrytis. So when you combine both of those effects, then fungicide application will control the leaf diseases in the field and help to reduce neck rot and storage. There are things that you can't uh, control, such as the weather, and if it's uh, uh, wet around the time of harvest, um, that can certainly increase neck rot. Otherwise, it's um, uh, seeding on time, but mostly harvesting when the bulbs are mature, making sure that the necks are, have dried down um, before, before the onions go into storage. Learn more about controlling pests and diseases in the field by reading Vegetables West magazine. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgNet.com.